is the MTRCB's charter, and this is what we follow. Mm. So, I'm sorry, this is the charter that we follow. Our mandate is to deliver, of course, value-based media and entertainment. And, of course, to protect the minds of our children from anything that may cause their minds um, any form of disturbance. And so, this is the, pres the presidential decree of 1986. According to, to the PD 1986, the MTRCB Charter, walang malinaw na guidelines as to our jurisdiction over online streamers or on-demand video providers because it was created during the time when there was no internet oh, yet. Yes, yes. Kaya, um, pero actually, technically, meron eh. But of course, we want to be very clear. We want clear guidelines. That's why we are proposing an amendment to the charter. But with uh, Netflix, it's um, it's been great. That's why we've been fostering partnerships with uh, um, with uh, online streaming providers, Gaia on Netflix, Amazon Prime, and all the others. They've already started to reach out and we're already in dialogues. But it all began talaga with Netflix. So I'm just so thankful because uh, this is <clears throat> this is a good way, diba? When your partners, you work together and you understand each other better, communication lines are open without the animosity, without <clears throat> having to go against each other. So you'll have healthy discussions and that's what Netflix and MTRCB is today. Were they, were they uh, initially uh, resistant to the idea? No, no. We've uh, been um, in constant communication with them. We've been in dialogues with them. And I appreciate them so much because they respect the mandate of the MTRCB. What about the Biba Max? Oh, oh. The Biba Max oh, no, Parang yun ang, yun ang medyo <laughs> mainit eh. Yung favorite na sila. <laughs> with Netflix yes and so um, as I've said we're in constant communication they're up updated with their programs and their projects so we've turned out to be very good partners with them so they are aware of the responsible pananood program that that um, I have started. Okay, so responsible panunod is all about empowering and um, equipping the parents, engaging the parents, and encouraging them to be very much involved with um, their children's um, watching or viewing habits. And so, it's surprising that to learn that other su supervising adults and parents are not aware of parental control features in most of the apps. So I really want them involved because I understand also from the point of view of a mother. I have a, a 20 year old daughter and um, a 10 year old boy. No, So C20, she's above 18. She can decide for herself. She can choose whatever she wants to watch. Pero si 10 year old boy, talagang I'm very particular with the kind of material that that he sees and that's what I want the parents to know that they have that power and they should exercise that right of theirs to be able to choose the kind of content that their children are exposed to so the Netflix partnership what's good is they understand the Filipino core family values and that they will take into consideration into their classification ratings, whatever uh, material or film that they will be um, choosing to to exhibit in our country, they'll be considering these core family values and they support the responsible panonood program. Even before man, may parental control ang Netflix. Yes, eh. and that's why we're going to be holding workshops and mm. summits that will be um, with Netflix also, and aside from that, that would be part of the Responsable Panonood program, we'll be having a family summit to explain to them extensively, comprehensively, 
how to utilize, how to best utilize these tools. How does that work? The Your parental control features. The, the MPRCB, does it monitor Netflix? Actually, I cannot say the word monitor. Or you mm -hmm. We cannot means? monitor. I mean, nag reklamo, siguro. They will, yes. So we'll just base it on feedback. Mm -hmm. We'll base it on feedback that if um, if there is a concern, which has happened already, the MTRCB forwarded to them a particular concern from a particular material, and Movies they were able to take I'm action. Movies so I think that's a very healthy way. Uh oh. Because chair, di ba na isip nila pag MTRCB, akala puro kat agad. Parang ganon na yung dating agad. Do you consider ba yourself ano? Mm. Ah, parang liberal or no, more I, conservative? I, I'm not liberal. I am oh. conservative. Mm -hmm. I am conservative. It's just that I want everything to be done legally. Mm -hmm. So what's in our charter is what we follow. Mm -hmm. um, the MTRCB is not a censorship board. We are a classification board. Yeah. Which means we only rate and yeah. classify the material yeah. according <laughs> to the age appropriateness that we apply. So, so far, mula ng pagupo mo, may na ex na ba kayo? So far, parang mula pa naman ako na rin. Sa aming mga board members na may issue about ex, wala. The highest rating we've given is R18. They come back for a second review. We appreciate that the producers themselves do their own um, self-regulation in order to get a lower classification. So that's what's happening. Nakapag-review na kayo ng MMFF movies? Ongoing um, reviews for the MMFF movies. I don't, the chair does not review. It's the board members who review the material. But I am aware of who reviews what, <coughs> And when and the rating classification that is given to each film. I remember our par partnership with the ex execom ng MMFF. Yes. Mm. <laughs> Exciting! Uh, I'm so excited for the MMFF because uh, this is the first time that uh, we've gathered a lot of films, mm -hmm. diba? Tapos may variety and nabubuhay ulit yung ating cinemas, yung ating movie industry. Parang may mga controversial na entries ngayon, no? Ngayon pala, nag-iingay ka. Meron ba? Oo! May tayo yung mga teaser. Oo! Controversial. Para sa ka mama sa pano. For sure, mag-iingay yun. Pero hindi pa tapos eh, yung aming reviews sa MMF. Kasi may, they are, they have the right to ask for a second review if they're not satisfied with a particular rating classification that the MTRCB has given them. So, so my process. Shows, meron kayong uh, sampulan ngayon na uh, parang mga <laughs> nireklamo. Yes, yeah, so oh, marami, but... Like? <laughs> I, I prefer not to mention. Oh, meron. But, of course, we do. But na we just, naman we address naman them. Yan. Yes, we address them accordingly. Meron mm -hmm. mong we call the attention. Ah, marami. Okay. Parang to specify kung ano ba talaga. Maraming marami, but I believe that I'm not at liberty at the moment to discuss in particular the specifics of the amendment to the charter because we have yet to complete the draft of the amendment that I will be submitting to our Lawmakers. Matagal na proseso ito? Matagal na proseso but I'm so thankful <laughs> that our lawmakers are very supportive. And they themselves have their own amendments and of course MTRCB will always abide by the law. Kumusta yung budget ng ibinigay sa MTRCB for the next year? Maayos ba? Okay ba? The MTRCB budget uh, kami naman yung nagpo-propose and mm. we just ask for what we really need. Fortunately, we only get um, the personal services from the national government. The MTRCB has its own income 
we have our own revenue and that's where we get our MOOE, <coughs> our programs and projects and our capital outlay. But of course, with the permission and in coordination with the DBM. Kaya hindi ganun kahirap ang budget ng MTRCT because we get it from our own funds. Maganda ba yung pakikipag-interact mo sa ibang mga government agencies na related sa pelikula yeah, so, and oh, television? Yes, lalo-lalo na FDCP. Oh. Kasi, <laughs> of course, hindi oh. kami pion. Oh. Eh. Oh. <laughs> Kaya we're really um, very comfortable working together. Oh. Pabilis ka nakapag-adjust sa pagiging chair. Praise God, oo. I think it helped a lot that I grew up with my mom being in the industry and my, my dad being there, of course. Mm-hmm. Diba? Binata at dalaga pa lang yung mga magulang ko. Nasa <laughs> television and movie industry na sila pareho. Pero stressful pa ba sa'yo ngayon o hindi na? Fully adjusted ka na? Actually, hindi. Kasi galing ako sa local government. Oh. So, uh, I think God prepared me for... Oh. For this, I'm not saying it's easy. Uh-huh. It's definitely still challenging, but by God's grace, kaya naman. So far, so good. You were counselor for a long time. Eighteen years in Quezon City. So, di ba? Parang bata ka pa, medyo sanay ka na. Plus, I have a very dynamic and hardworking board. We have thirty board members and a vice chairman. Kompleto na. Yes, complete, mm-hmm. and they're all very, very helpful. Each of them, um, they come from different walks of life. See and you from that, the industry, in the board. In the board, no. we have uh, BM Val Soto, oh. <laughs> BM Luke Meharis, BM That's Paulo it. Santos, uh, BM Moy Moy Macasero. Mm-hmm. Yes, oh, oh. Pero at uh, madami kasing ano pa eh, na kaka-request ko lang. Kaka-request ko lang. But majority of them are already board members. I'm just asking for their requesting for their appointment. But that's not up to me. That's up to the president. Si Johnny Revilla. Yes, of course, BM Johnny Revilla. Isa sa super super sipag, super asset. BM Johnny Revilla. Initially na na <laughs> I don't know. I'm not privy to what had happened then, but we're very close. We have a great working relationship, and he's such an asset to the board. I I love BM Johnny so much. Did you aim for this, or you were just post, or what? No, this is a pleasant surprise. To oh, okay. Me. So what? I know. I know. What transpired? Why? Why are you now? Why are you now? <laughs> Tanong natin yung presidente. <laughs> <laughs> Pero talaga yung ano, sa amin talaga good choice. Uh, Salamat po. Yes, ang bahagay. Actors. Talaga, so sa close up. Salamat po. Yes, lalo na may parents. Talaga, uh, mahal na mahal nila yung ano sabi nila? Industry. Best friend ni Ma'am Helen. Yes, <laughs> of course. Ano sabi, sabi nila? Na? Super happy and super proud. Of course. May mga advice Yes, of course, maraming advice. Araw-araw may advice. Ano na si Daddy? Paulit-ulit. But basically, it's just always to to follow your heart and never allow others to to um, to sway your values. More on ganyan. Especially your, your spiritual convictions and my parents would always ask me to be respectful and be always be very fair. To always be very <clears throat> fair. Ano yung parang pinaka-concerned mo ngayon, Chair? Sa ngayon, pinaka-priority sa mga projects o ng MTRCB? In general, oh. it's to empower our local producers to and encourage them to come up with films that are globally competitive. And films that will focus more on the Filipino core family values. And of course, may angat natin, di ba, sa ibang bansa. Makilala rin yung ating mga super talented artists. We have great artists, di ba? 
kumakatan ka rin sa mga international film fest para mas Actually, I haven't been able to because napakadaming work dito. So um lately kapag may kinakailangan puntahan outside the country, I request for our vice chairman to <laughs> to represent me. Oh. I believe I I'm needed here more, but in the coming months, maybe in the future, I will have to attend at one time or another. Yes, we have. We, we shot the first part already of the new infomercial for the cinemas. Yes. I'm so proud that it's directed by Jaco de Leon. Oh. Oh, oh. Super galing si Jaco. Yes, our previous chair. But so, responsible panonood. Panonood pa rin. Yes, Because. tumo sa responsible panonood yung magiging thirst talaga. Mm -hmm. Because that's the program that I really want to focus mm -hmm. on. But yung part ko wherein I will be delivering a message, mm -hmm. we have yet to um, set that. Ni pa namin na shoot. Report next year niyan. Oh, we're shooting in two weeks. With fewer movies being made, so is, is the NPRCB a very busy agency? It's a very busy agency. There are a lot of movies coming in now, especially with the MMFF. Wow. We are very busy. We don't only review mo motion pictures, we also review television programs and publicity materials as well, including the, the trailers, movie trailers. Social media? Social media, no. Not yet. <laughs> not yet because it's not included in our. Yes, we sent our USB. We sent our um, monitoring inspection units, and kapag may nakita sila na may lumabag, then we issue notices of violation. Or violation kasi, notices. Ano, diba? Meron silang producer friend yung NPRCB. Meron din uh, producer enemy maker. <laughs> <laughs> Wala. I try to be as fair as I can. Okay. So, yun. Yeah. Para clear kasi doon. <laughs> Wala kami enemies. Okay. But it's up to them, of course, if they will take it against us when they don't agree with uh, the particular mm -hmm. classification that we give them. Kasi siyempre mga kaibigan din namin yung mga producers. Oh. Yes, so sinilig ko sa amin na, na may mga ganyan-ganyan. Sino dati ah? May wala pa. <laughs> Sir, may I ask how old you are? I'm 46. Oh, hindi ba yung iba para masyadong bata ang tingin sa'yo? Nung ibang bata members? Bata pa ba yun? Oh. Yung ibang members, considering sa ano, parang ah, maging okay, Ed. Ah, okay, because oh, our board members oh, oh, oh. are older. Yes. I don't think it's ever been an issue. I've mm -hmm. never heard of so experience wise naman kasi siya eh experience chair chair ano ko lang po bakit hindi kayo nag artist ayun ang pang finale question grand finale question natin hindi niyo tinanong ayoko talaga well when i was little ang ang hypocrite ang hypocrite naman ako to admit na nung bata ako gusto ko siya mag artist i mean gusto ko mag artist but nung paglaki ko ayaw ko na talaga. Singer. I, I don't know why. I sing in the shower. <laughs> And so, sa TV. Yes, my heart is really in public service. I really enjoy public service. I I, I enjoy politics. Pero may mga offers na Before, yes, that's it. Oh. Nung buhay pa si Kuya Germ. So, oh. <laughs> 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 Siyempre pa si Kuya Germ. Oh. Oh. Si, ano, Federico Moreno. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> eh, lahat naman basta anak ng artista, oh. di ba? Ayaw ka lang. Ayaw. Ayaw ka lang. Ayaw that's a game. No, you know what? I'm, uh, it might surprise you. But I'm a very shy person. Yun ang dahilan. Kaya ayaw. Yeah, I think so. I don't know nga eh, pag-rally naman ng kapal-kapal ko. Saan hindi ka pinilang chair? Pinilang. Oh, my parents aren't like that. For my parents, kung anong gusto mo, they'll just support you. They'll tell you the pros and cons, disadvantages and advantages. They'll discuss everything with you to the 
to the littlest detail but at the end of the day it's whatever will make you happy and whatever will bring glory to the Lord they will support speaking of your parents share who's the na sila they enjoy more quality time now. yes my, my mom is enjoying um, being with my dad 24-7 Except pag sumasali ng mga tournaments yung dad ko. But, of course, he's always in Eat Bulaga. Hindi na mawawala sa kanya yun. And I heard he's going to have a show in F25. Yeah. A public affairs show. Punta silang Dubai, I think eh. Oh, ang nabalitaan ko rin eh. November, uh, ano? Oo, oh, oh, buti pa kayo. Ano, oh. you know? May poster kasi eh. <laughs> ah, talaga? Oo. Oh, oh. Okay, baka may promo sila. Oo. Oh, oh. Hindi ako aware. Hindi <laughs> siya 